Hi, good evening. It's me, Gian, and today it's a bit late in the evening here. But since my scalp has been bothering me the whole day, I will be doing a review on this product. It's the Head and Shoulders um, New Supreme Line. Mm. First, yep, I know that this packets or sachets will pollute the ocean and will add to global warming and will also help contribute to make the Philippines the third largest plastic uh, plastic polluter of the ocean in the whole wide world however unfortunately i cannot buy the big bottle of shampoo if i haven't tried out the small one and if you're asking me why i bought um a lot of sachets it's because um at our local sari sari store i cannot just buy one it's not yet available at the sari sari store in the corner and also, I need to use this for a couple of days to test how it will work with my hair. Okay, so first off, I don't know if head and shoulders is trying to fool me. So I'm, I'm really big in reading labels. So when I read this, I was so confused because it says here, um, this green one is has Moroccan argan cream. This one on the other hand, um, the gold one, has Moroccan argan cream as well. And if you are going to compare the arrangement of the ingredients that they use and compare all the ingredients here, they are all the same. However, this one, the green one, claims to smoothen out the hair <coughs> and make it three times smoother. Forgive me for my coughing. And this one um, claims that it moisturizes your hair 10 times. However, for this episode, I am not going to talk about this because I haven't been, I haven't used this yet. But we will be talking about this because I have already used two sachets of this. And that is where my problem comes from and the only change in my routine is this in my hair routine is this because I cut my hair short so I don't need conditioner at this point right now and I haven't used any gel or wax on my hair because these days I don't seem to need, need it. It's not as humid as it used to like in the summer. Okay, now, however, after using this for a week, my scalp has micro microdermabrasion. What do you call that? Like I could feel that my some some parts of my scalp has this you know those dried out um oh scabs okay my scalp has scabs on it like small ones so what i think is this shampoo is just too harsh in my hair just too harsh in my hair because as you can see i have one here and then you know, I have one here and another one here. And that just feels so weird. Because when I use this on my hair, 
it doesn't sting. However, after using it for a week, there are the scabs. But I don't have dandruff. That's the, that's the plus side. Maybe because... Because I'm removing all my dandruff, it also removed part of my scalp. Now, let me um, discuss with you argan oil. I know I did a discussion the last time about argan oil and how and its benefits for the skin. This time around, argan oil and its benefits for the hair. Now, what I know from argan oil, it says that, you know, if, if you have brittle hair and if you have chemically treated hair and you want to repair it the best um, uh, argan oil would help regrowth however I find that claim weird because this is like dead dead keratin already so if it's dead how could you fix the chemical damage there it's already damaged maybe someone could um, explain how argan oil could fix the damage here. I, I need to know the pathophysiology of it because I cannot believe it. And maybe someone could also tell me about the biochemical reaction of argan oil to the keratin composition and matrix of the hair. Because I, I don't, in my mind, I do not know how that is possible. Anyways, um, so if I'm going to purchase Argan Oil again, um, Head & Shoulders Supreme Smooth again, the answer is no. So, but guys, if, if you have tested this out and if you have used this product um, for yourself, can you please tell me? what your reaction to it was maybe it's just me but the last time i had this reaction was when i was in high school and my friend and i tried a cheap uh, straightening salon and our scalp got burned that was the closest experience I have to what I am experiencing right now not as terrible but as I've said I've, as I've told you I've got three um three sore spots right now so there goes that's why I needed to record this tonight bye